we are back in uh, Glendora today. And uh, honestly, 15th day, should be 15th, yeah, 15th. So every day I come out riding, it's uh, breaking my record for uh, consecutive days on the pedals. Uh, I think the toughest challenge for me is um, trying to, first of all, figure out where to ride. <laughs> That's always like the thing. Like sometimes, like the Laguna ride, it was like, I don't know, should I go, should I not go, should I go, should I not go? I'm always trying to not make my trail rides repetitive because if it's repetitive, it's, you guys are gonna be like, dude, this guy is just doing the same thing every day. It's kind of boring. So I'm gonna try to keep it fresh, but also at the same time, I don't wanna push myself to the point where I'm getting hurt like if I go to Greer every day. Uh, if I do that, then you know, this 365 challenge is gonna be like, it's insane. So this challenge is tough. So it's gonna be trying to manage where I ride, trying to manage the amount of riding, uh, the amount of like, I could do Greer, and then I gotta chill for two days or go back to Vail and then chill for two days or three days. Um, I'm gonna ride my, you know, ride with Ellen here, um, those chill days, you know, get her involved in the, in the mindset, you know, waking up early, accomplishing things that you never think you could do. I mean, waking up at four and starting your day early, get your mountain bike riding down and then you can go back to, you can go to work even though it's like the hardest thing to do. But a lot of people, you know, they have to commute two hours, which is really just crazy. Um, even if you commute two hours, when you come back to work, you're just hella tired. You know, I understand that. I was in that position before. Say you, you, you work at nine and you have to leave the house by seven. And uh, if you wake up at four, that's four, five, six, seven. It's three hours that you can actually get out there, complete your local ride, head out to work. Because I guarantee you, when you're in that car, you won't be pissed. Because you'll sit in that car commuting with a smile. And that, that's pretty important. And uh, I think that's good for mental health. So on to today's main topic. Uh, I think right now we are standing at like 127 um, subscribers. And uh, what I'm going to do is... I want to let everybody know that uh, I think we need to hit 150 people. We need to hit 150 subscribers first. I think what I'm going to do is every 50 subscribers that I get, I'm going to host a giveaway. And the giveaway is a pair of Maxi's DHF 2.5 and DHR 2.4 rears. So. At 150, uh, what we're gonna do is, um, at that 150 marker, that day, that video, I will let everybody know on my Instagram, or let everybody know on that video, on that day, that you can leave the comments inside that, uh, that post on that day, on 150 subscribers, which I will make, I will notify everybody. So once we pass 150, that's when I'll make that video, and then, um, and I'll use a random comment picker. And uh, whoever makes a comment, like, hey, what's up, send it Frankie, awesome, I watch your video all day, whatever, all right? <laughs> whatever comment you wanna make, make that comment, I'll use a comment picker, and then once the comment picture picker picks that person, you know, I'll ship out the, the tires for free. So I'll do that at 150, I'll do that at 200, and I hope you guys you know, get your friends involved and like, hey, you know, go to Send the Frankie's channel and then just subscribe and make a comment and then you can win some tires, which is pretty cool. Uh, so I hope you guys get to, you know, set, give that message out to your friends um, in this video. Uh, and uh, I will also post that up on my Instagram and all that stuff and uh, just to let everybody know. So. Uh, we'll continue riding and uh, we're gonna get up top, come back down, <laughs> take the wifey to work, the day, the usual day, we head to work with a smile and uh, you start your day with a smile and then I'm pretty sure you know that any day that you start with a smile, you're gonna have a great day. All right, we are gonna descend early. Uh, we're gonna go back, we got our footage, we got our shots, and uh, 
going to descend down. Probably you guys probably noticed every time I ride my wife, I need to go slow. <laughs> I can't, I don't want to push it so hard that I leave her behind. And then, you know, if anything happens, <laughs> I don't know where she's at. So I usually tend to go slower and uh, try to listen to her uh, free hug coasting. And I can hear her. I mean, so she's still behind me. <laughs> 